Sorry. This is not expected. I have a bit of a having a meeting with you. PJ. Yeah. You were informed about the meeting, weren't you? Yeah, but I thought it was the management staff, but the judge might look at my face. I'm sit sure down, that's... PJ, sit down. I'm here for serious business. Sit down. Fifty million naira. Vanished into thin air. Gone like that. Can you explain to me how you spent fifty million naira? Nancy, I, I invested in this side business. Shut up. Shut up. What side business? You cannot even function as the CEO of this company and now you claim that you, you invested in a side business? What side business? You think we're fools here? What is wrong with you? Are you on drugs? Uh, you really need to chill. Like your blood pressure is... And you? Problem. How could you allow this to happen? Dad, there was no way I could stop him. Because he has access to the company's accounts. Besides, every time I accosted him about the money he takes from the company coffers, he becomes aggressive and defensive. Dad, I complained to you severally. But you just ignored me. I granted him the right to sign checks and access funds as the COO because I thought he would be responsible. PJ has never been responsible with money. And you knew it. Can I be given a chance to explain what exactly I did with this money? No! Because I know you were not responsible with it. You know what? I am placing you on an indefinite suspension starting today. <laughs> I want you to clear out your desk because your replacement commences on Monday. <laughs> you can't be serious. I am dead serious. In addition, your access to company funds has been restricted. What? You can't just put me in a spot like that. We'll see about that. I have given an instruction to the company's security not to allow your access into the premises starting Monday. And in the event that you become recalcitrant and you do not willingly comply with this, I will invite the police to physically throw you out. This is preposterous. And go. of you just because of you mom you know how dad gets when he's upset he just talks anyhow you know this patrick you're 33 years old single and shameless your mates are out there running multi national companies you are here sitting in your father's house eating food chasing women up and down changing them like soiled Pampers, how oh, you do spend money? The money that your father worked hard for. The business he solely built by himself. I think you should be ashamed of yourself. Mom, what you and dad need to do is give me a second chance to write my wrongs. By the way, do you know that he put me on indefinite suspension at the office? That's all. He should have chased you out of this house. So you will support him chasing me out of this house? Oh, hell yes. I will. 
We've supported you so much. It is time for you to go out there. Pen for yourself. Look at the world. See what you can do for yourself. Because you are so used to the privileges, the comfort of this home. So, so if you guys kick me out of this house, where am I supposed to go? One of your useless friends, those stars that you go to and once you call friends, you can go stay with them. Or better yet, get a place of your own. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know that you're joking. No, I'm not joking. I'm not joking anymore. Fam. Trust me, you need to leave this house. Go and think for yourself. Go and search. Go and look around. <laughs> know what your mates are doing. Mom. By the time you do all that, you come back and tell us that you're responsible. Mom, it's not like that. I'm talking to you. <laughs> So you expect to leave this house? I think you should leave me and we'll go and fight. Mom? Mom? I'm being serious here. The part that's been pissing me off the most, eh, is that my father is acting so heartless. And my mom, she's been supporting him. Is it not indefinite leave? Mm. <laughs> you should be happy your dad didn't throw you out that right now. At least you still have a chance to go back to work. See, that's my point. I think the man just wants you to stay away from the company a while. Do you understand? Just a little while. When his anger is done, bro, man, <laughs> you know your way back to the office. Mm. What's even bothering me? Is that my mom is actually insinuating that my dad wants to kick me out of the house? <laughs> Come on, guy, You're getting yourself all worked out. I mean, it's just metric. She's just trying to scare you a little bit. You are the only son, right? Yeah. Come on, she can't afford to pull the rug under your feet. How are you gonna stand? See, I get you, bro. This thought is just wrapped around my head. Don't you think they are just trying to pull a little threat on you so that you take them more seriously and you'll be scared, you know? And trust me, it's actually working. Bro, your leg is shake now. <laughs> Man, yeah, that's... Life, life, no serious like this. I'm talking okay, okay. But see, yeah. Uh... Well, I mean, I understand. I mean, I kind of fucked up and everything, but... I mean, I'm not supposed to do this now. Check out. Guys, guys, guys. It's Friday. My point exactly. We're supposed to be getting high, drinking, having fun. Y yes, you look a little bit scared, but yo, this is Friday. Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. No. What do you mean you're not going anywhere? It's Friday night. Let's go out and have fun. Dala, I am not in the mood. You're always not in the mood. You're letting life slip past you. Dala, you see, some of us prefer quiet evenings at home. It's okay, but not today. I understand you, but not today. Okay, let's go out today. I said no. Oh, there's a new bar opening on the island. Baby, let's go now. Free food, drinks, fresh guys, to eat, to mingle, to mingle, to mingle. Let's go, baby, baby, let's go. Look, I only just want you to follow me so that I don't go and get drunk and follow a guy home. You know how I do now. Then don't go. Why would I go? Lots of food to drink. Free food, though. 
Fresh guys, fresh guys. I don't you never change. It's okay. I tell you. I tell you. It's okay. Fine. It's okay. Okay. Just this one, so. Eh, Dala. If you try to match make me, eh, I will never speak with you again. Eh, I will never match make you because of bad markets. Trust me. Hey, come to your students. Bad markets. Let's go. Let's go. Wear something nice. Wear something hard. Wear something sweet. That lying. Cheating bastard! She's not what you are. She's not what you are. Tony had the guts to stare me in the face and accuse me of trying to play the victim. Where does he buy his audacity from? I hate to say this, but you brought it upon yourself. How? That guy is a lying, cheating bastard and you know it! I love him. Look, I know Tony can be a jerk sometimes, but I try to look beyond that to see his good side. There is nothing good about Tony. What are you talking about? His heart is as bitter as, as unripe and bad, Umar. What are you saying? I feel like a fool right about now. Amanda, you had this coming. He's shown you countless times that he doesn't love you. What is wrong with you? I'm sorry I ruined your night. It's okay, it's okay. I'm you didn't sorry. ruin my night. It's okay, it's okay. I just saw some cute guys there and. It's okay, stay. Stay, stay. What's he talking about, man? I hate them. I know, I love them. It's fine, it's okay. We'll be fine. One guy. Patrick. Mm. So after everything that happened yesterday, you still went out clubbing and drinking? What is wrong with you? Where did we go wrong? That, that, not now. I have this blinding headache. Please. I can see you feel no remorse whatsoever. Hi, baby. <laughs> Can you just go back to the room, please? Just go back. That's not my name. Yeah, yeah whatever it is, please. You will not do this in my house again. Before the end of tomorrow evening, I expect you to move out. You want to kick me out? Yes. You've been disrespecting this home by bringing in all sorts of loose girls. I will not allow it to happen anymore. By tomorrow evening, I expect you to move out. Otherwise, I'll get you arrested for breaking and entering. I Fool. What was all that stunt you pulled up last night? I'm talking to you. You don't want out of me when I'm talking to you. Oh, <laughs> you, you're trying to play the silent treatment on me, right? And when I'm talking to you, answer me. Don't drink tea on me. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. I'm under you. Me? Get out of my house! Oh, you're still here, man? Amanda! Amanda! Hey, 
my baby sister. <laughs> What's up now? How you doing? I'm uh, good. <laughs> did you just stock up? Oh yeah, I just did. As you can see, everywhere is full. Looks really good. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm making a lot of money. I mean, working at Patero and also having this business on the side, it's really good. We have to make the money while we're young, Abi. No, mm -hmm. <laughs> Very, very true. I'm a bit worried though. All this money, you might chase away potential suitors. Excuse me, if my suspects intimidate any man, that means that man is not meant for one. True, true, <laughs> very true. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, I um, I need a favor. Okay. Uh, mom and dad kicked me out of the house. So I need to get my own place. So I need a loan from you. I promise I'll square you back once I'm settled. Okay? What? Hey, Dani, I'll call you right back. Casey! Casey! <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't expecting you until evening. Uh, um, well, I came to give you details about what's going on in the Dozy family, but I guess your brother beat me to it. He was just telling me that mom and dad asked him to move out. Ah, finally. It was about time. Don't you have a family to take care of? PJ, what did you do? Huh. Your brother mismanaged 50 million naira company's fund. 50 million naira? Mm -hmm. uh, that has exactly his revenge, okay? He has more or less kicked me out of the company and asked me to move out of the house. What more do you have to go about? You know, to think that mom was really upset with that for not making you the CEO of the company. Just imagine what would have happened. And now that you are CEO and you are doing well, okay, I want you. Huh? <laughs> You know, your sarcasm is childish. And I can't blame you. It's not easy transiting from an Abuja big boy into a penniless jet. Well, it's okay. I mean, you've always been jealous of me because our parents have always favored me over you, so yeah. It's fine. Hmm, really? Mm-hmm. But here you are. Penniless. Broke. <laughs> And about to be homeless. You know what, guys? I'm done with this. Screw you guys. I'm out. I'm leaving. I'm leaving the house. I don't want anything and any help from you guys. Uh, PJ, PJ, goodbye. PJ, wait. Hey, wait. good. I love him. Jeez. Oh, wait, sis. Fifty million naira. Oh, please, 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 please. You never loved him. That guy keeps cheating on you. He kept on cheating on you. Yet you open your wide mouth and be defending him. But Dala, yet you, you be saying, hey, when we get married, this is a womanizing thing. It will be out of his system. How? Dala, there's nothing wrong in settling down with someone you love. You do not love Tony. Please. It is desperation. It is spirit of desperation Fine. that is making you sound Fine. like Fine. It's okay. It's okay. Shabit, the relationship is over now. You're happy. I'm happy. I don't even know what to eat this evening. Like, I'm excited. Babe, let me tell you, you did the right thing, though. You did the right thing. A broken relationship is better than an awful marriage. Please. You're right. I'm right. Yes. Can't let me buy your ice cream, Jare. What are you saying? What do you want to eat this evening? Stupid guy. That guy never regarded you at all. Very useless human being. Devil. Idiot. So all the time. And you say, come here, come here, come, 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 let me buy you food, John. Come, let's let me go and buy you Chinese. Let's eat toast, toast to me. Sir, so I'm checking my mail right now. I, uh, I have not received the invoice for the last batch of delivery you did. I've not seen it. Okay, sir. I'll call you once I get it. Thank you. Mr. Okelawe, you need to fire everybody in his accounts department. Very stupidly incompetent people. That's what happens when you employ family members from your business instead of employing competent professionals. Who is that, Tony? Yes. Why would he leave me alone? Uh, he think it's that easy for an oppressive man to leave his victim. See, I'm his clothes to working. Which clothes? This clothes. This clothes. Yes. You that I know. You that I know that you're enjoying his disturbing phone calls. Yeah, this clothes is me. This clothes is you. Yeah, man, voila. I don't understand. Just be secure. It's kind of me. I'm not just going to call this man again. I'll, I'll, I'm just going to leave him. I won't be disturbing you to send him.
Put your enter somewhere, come somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. 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 Where are we go now? Wait, wait, wait. Baba, what is it with this man? I see the smoke. What tire? Sales. Baba, come, come, come. Leave that thing, leave that thing. Fall in, fall in. Hey, bad guy. Come, 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 come inside, yeah? here. <laughs> <laughs> Kill me, bro. <laughs> Shoot me here. <laughs> What about you guys then? That, what did I call ourselves? That day? Um, finest boys in Abuja. Can Abu we stop? No, no, can we stop, please? <laughs> what happened? Those are my guys. Hmm. As soon as everything started happening and I was kicked out, I was looking for a place to stay. They kept on bouncing me around. <laughs> you only that one of them would have the audacity to tell me that his landlady said no to squatters. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick, it does it in your PJ. Yeah, that one pain, I'm now a squatter. I swear, that one pain, yeah? yeah. That. <laughs> but you can't blame them. No, 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 no. See, I do blame them. Why? Because I was generous to them. Mm. I showed them nothing but love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When all this happened, what did they do when I fell on hard times? Which hard times? Hard times. Shut up. Which one is hard times? You don't ever, enter, you don't ever wake up 4 a.m. Maybe may you enter Mulue or boss hustle. Maybe you go, maybe go far, like three hours of traffic. Come back. Have you ever done that? What have you done? What have you made? What have you produced? It's obvious to say they cut your free money you ahead. Same difference. The difference. PJ, you fall hard. Look, I'll tell you the truth. You my guy. You fall hard. What happened to you? What guys in school? Everybody wants to be like you. Everybody was casual envious of you. Casual wanted <sighs> your parents. We're ready to do anything for you, and I'm sure they're still ready to do anything for you. And just you, they do yourself. Do what you is the problem? you think I've not been beating myself up because of this for last He's not beating yourself enough. Like, you're supposed to just lie down, let them flog you to 26. Your pa gave money. The money they smell, we know. If my pa had half, a quarter of the money your father had, I will not be here. I swear to God. I know we are for day. Look at, but look at what I have now. Imagine me back then, but see what I did. Eh? All self-made, made by myself. Nobody helped me. What? I self made that nobody helped me. That's fine. Mm. Can you write that money that I loaned you? I like it back, please. Thank you very much. I'll just go upstairs, pack my bags, and I'm out. Oh, no! Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, no, I'm leaving you! No, I'm leaving you! No, I'm leaving you! Babe, I actually came to apologize properly. I don't need your apologies! Don't you think you're faking this too far? You need to listen to me. These are based on your own assumptions. I have nothing doing with that girl. I know she has a crush on me. She pleaded that we have an hangout just for once and she'll be fine. That is why I did that. Tony, I don't care. All I want for you is stop calling my line or texting me. Is that too much for you to do? Or do you want me to call the security on you? Leave me alone! And as for you, Lide, I don't want to ever see this man here again. Have I made myself clear? I don't want to ever see him here again. Am I understood? No, said ma. Yes, ma. Alright, no problem. Go ahead. I will leave. 
But I need you to know that I'll not stop calling your phone. We're meant to be together. You need to understand that. Rubbish. Caro, write me letter. Inside the letter. PJ, you remember that? Ah. Uh ah. -uh. Uh, alcohol. PJ. This early morning. Ah. Uh -uh. happened, now, Baba? Nothing, Zara. Well, come with me now. Please come to my office and see what your investment is doing. Nah. Mm. I'm not in the mood. I feel like getting my hands and my feet dirty. Mm -hmm. you know, pig is not really my tough. Untouchable now. Why is it that when people hear about pig family, they just feel like it's dirty and all? But if you see pork meat now, I go now. Now you go, now you go and say you want chopper. So, but I just come and see what I'm doing now. Another time, man. I just want to bask in my depression and. You know. Look, Baba, if you are going to be doing moody, moody, moody here, then call your parents, beg them, and just go back to. Them. And you think I've not tried that? But that blocked me. No. Damn. Your dad must be very mad at you. Yeah. I mean, I've messed up countless times. He's fed up. I tried calling my mom and she have heard how cold she's standing on the phone. Truth is, I can't blame them. I can't. I can't. I've messed up too many times. So you think by drinking, getting drunk, and just sitting down all day, you convince them that you have changed? <clears throat> I see the toxic they drink, you still want poor more drink for here. I don't get bar for here. I know now, nah, but I don't get I don't get money like you did get money. Wait, wait, let me help you. Wait, 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 wait. No, give me my alcohol. Baba, my pal don't get money like your pa. No, I understand. On a, on a bad day, your pop is giving you like four million. On a good day, my pop is not giving you nothing. So I'll keep this when I get back to celebrate, okay? But I'm not letting you get drunk in my house. Crazy. Oh, crazy. Crazy! Please ask Miss Mama. You have a gift. Hi. Let me check on you. Let me do check on you. What's happening here? Babe, can I call you back, please? Alright. What's happening? What's, what's going on? I guess. Uh, Tony? Yeah. Ah! Okay, some desperado move. Are you sure this guy hasn't met a prophet who told him to make up with you because he's good luck child? Girl, that's his business. I'm returning his gift back. You will do not talk to him. Are you kidding me? They say I moved the wrong belay, but we need to run my belay. Come on, for what? How do you return what? For me? Come on. Dala. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So about the money I was asking you for earlier, is that still possible? Um, the truth is, I'm squatting with my friend in Lagos and I'm really desperate, please. This squatting life is not for me, please. Alina is happy with my present predicament. I'm not going to get at that point for her to gloat. I'd rather die than ask her for another couple. Mom is not answering my calls. Yeah, sure. Thanks. We'll talk. Bye. Hurting me recklessly 
breaking me endlessly Maybe lately It's cause of you are And acting crazy, crazy Don't say another word, I don't want another conversation Leading into arguments, even though I have that kind of energy No, no, I'm wasted on you, burning on you And the shit you do, all the lies you tell, all the things you do Man, I've had it out to you, the things you do All the lies you tell, all the ways to tell Fools, my dear. A leopard never changes its spots. What if this leopard has changed? Don't tell me you're already falling for his tricks. I'm just saying, what if he has truly changed? I know you. You won't be considering it if you haven't given it the positive thoughts. Why are you so gullible? Still, everyone deserves not, not someone like Tony. I can tell you the reason why he wants to get back with you. It's so he can dump you. His ego can't take it that you dumped him first. It's a lovely whiskey, you like it. I hope so. Yes, and um, just a little top up of mine. <laughs> okay. Um, um hold 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 it. Um I wanna make a toast to us. A toast to us for scaling through the obstacles, the turbulence, and um, overcoming it, and um, to the togetherness, let this be renewed, fulfilled in love and trust. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, I want to use this opportunity to tell you that I'm totally sorry for everything I've done, the fears, the hurt I, I have caused you. Sorry. All is forgiven, baby. Thank you, my love. Come on, come on. So, um, you see, Charles, I beg, I beg, try get them before the carpenter, please. Well, okay. 
Now come. Uh-huh, so BJ. Sorry, BJ. You were saying you're sex out. Just say that you're sex out. Stop messing with my name. Idiots. <laughs> so, dude, um, I've had a lot of idle time in my hands, but I've been thinking long and hard this last couple of days, and I've been thinking of what to do pending me being reinstated into my father's company. And so the first idea was to start a business. Mm. But the problem is I have no idea what business I want to do. You know, and even if I did find a business, I don't have the money to fund it. Mm. So I decided to go job hunting. It's not, it's not, it's not, it's not funny. Yeah. Because it's not, no. This job hunting is hard. Ha. Ah. It's terrible. Like it's the worst thing in life. Nobody even wants to hire me. Like nobody has called me back, bro. Hmm? See these guys. If the soul of your shoe never chop, they won't give you any job. And it's like they planned it. Like, yeah, if you want to employ anybody, make sure you look at their shoes. Bye, go waka. And the worst part is, did I employ you and pay like forty k, fifty k? That's looking so now. No, 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 no. I don't mind. Mm. Truth is, black guys are not choosing. I will take a 50k job right now. Ah, I'm serious. No, 50k in my pocket is better than no money in my pocket at all. And while I have that 50k in my pocket, you know, hopefully I, that will help me buy some time to beg my parents to forgive me and take me back. It gets better. So imagine if I'm doing this job, I have 50k in my pocket once a month, and then I drop it randomly in the conversation with my baby sister. She goes to tell them. It just proves to them that I'm not idle or just wasting my time. Good morning. Good morning. You know visitors are not allowed in here. You know that. He's the new operations assistant. He doesn't look it at all. He looks expensive. <clears throat> uh, uh, these these things are they're borrowed from my friend. Cool. Get your shoe off. Skills will soon finish. <laughs> um. Oh. Okay. Um. My name is Amanda, and she's Dala. What's your name? Nice. Nice to meet you, Amanda. I'm, I'm, I'm Patrick. My name is Patrick. Okay. Um, Mr. Patrick, you're welcome to Bricks Bay Company. I hope you enjoy working here with us. Uh, thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, that, that's uh, it's a very unusual name. I like it. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck,
Let's walk. Walk. Let's walk. Is this stressful? This is more than stress. I'm talking about never just the actual work. Mm. But when you see the main office, the back to the operations office. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. My feet are killing me. Yeah. Now, understand why we made the carry sleepers to work. Aha! <laughs> what are the traffic now? You call that traffic. That's a roadblock. <laughs> Makes no sense. How do you guys cope in this town? Uh -huh. People are just snookering people left and right. Well, yeah. I know you must be hungry, so I just finished eating. Food day for kids, you know. Man, I need that food. But right now, mm. I just need to take a shower. Yeah, because you're smelling. Emeka, I promise you, mm. once I get reinstated in Patedo, I'm giving every low-level worker a raise. You see that thing I was telling you now? See, this 40k, 50k, you know the next step. You something. see the worker now. It's something. I know. I forget you. It's something. I'll manage. I'm just coming back now. See, traffic. I will manage. Is that the, uh, the fund for the social studying project? Yes, sir. Uh, you seem to be this company's biggest client. Of course they are. And everyone is trying their best to... And that's why we're all trying to bend over back to satisfy them. Yeah. I remember how this company works really hard. It's impressive. Yes, everyone is trying to, especially now that the company is under new management. New management? Yes. The former MD of this company passed away and left the company to his son, who almost wrecked it until another company bought it over. <coughs> so, uh, um, what about Bala? She's not coming today or she has... Oh, she so, went to... Oh. Hiya! How are you guys doing? That's not great. You ran great? Yeah. He's wearing a boyfriend that cost about 100k. There's something. Something about you just doesn't have a. I don't know. Is it me? No, not just you. No, no, no. Uh, the, 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 um... The, the thing is, my, my friend that I'm staying with owns, owns a business and I, I, I'm, I'm sharing his, his things. Your friend, what's his name? Emeka. Does he have money? Depends on your definition of money. Aha! You know that soon. Hey, hey! Hey, Mika. Hey, we good? Yeah, we're good. PJ, mm -hmm. are you joining us? I'm not going to see a friend of mine, so I'll be finding my way. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. I guess I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Okay. And, uh, All right, PJ. Yeah, you too. Bye, yeah. Night night. Good. What was that about? What? What do you mean? What's up with you suddenly closing this with this guy? What does he think it's somehow? Oh, PJ? Uh -uh. He's my colleague. He is new. And he's nice. What's wrong in me being nice to someone that is nice to me? Excuse me, point of correction, he's your junior colleague. Please. So? Because of that, I shouldn't be nice to him. Is oh, that the problem I have with you? You are too nice! When someone smiles with you, you, you shake back your full decision. That's why they take advantage of you. Ah! Oh. Dala, my friend. Niceness is not something you heard. It's something you give out freely. But what I'm saying is be civil about it. With him especially. Don't be too... too chummy, you know. You get what I mean? You understand? Hmm? 
Yes. You don't get? Yes, ma. So can we go now? Yes, ma. Nobody's paying you. us over, e over time here. <laughs> okay. Pack your things and let's move. It's fine. Mommy, mommy, you're not coming with us. Mommy, you're not coming with us. I want to take breakfast. I want to eat. Oh, please, I'm very very not time for that. So what? Uh, okay. Amanda, what is that? Can you what? Never mind. Bella, wait! Bella! Babe. I think she's mad at me. Why would she be mad at you? Is she a babysitter? She's my closest friend. Oh, come on, babe. Listen, you know you need to take charge of your life and leave her out of this. Okay? Come on, she's much of a bad to, to you then. I know. She's my closest friend. She's only checking out on me. Then what am I here for? I'm here to watch out for you. I'm here to take care of you. You don't need anyone else to do that for you. Listen, just come here. I don't know, I feel like, I feel like she's, she's on to me. <laughs> you don't start again. All these girls are always on to me. She, she looks at me like, like, she knows who I really am. Maybe you don't know these girls we don't have any sex. It's a bad guy. I have not had sex with this girl. I, mean, I would know. I mean, her name is very unique, Dala. And her personality is, is rather infectious. Maybe there's something you're doing or something you did that's making her suspicious. Because okay, so, so this is what happens. She, she talks about my perfume, the way I dress, my wristwatch. You feel you think she'd be Yahoo boy on the, on the low key. Or, that's why afraid, you can't afford all these things you're doing. Fair point. But you know what? I think what I need to do is I need to change my wardrobe. For what now? Why do you want to waste money? I get old shirts for here now if you wear them. That year for school, they were the same size, I mean. That was that year, for mm -hmm. school. Okay, right now I'm bigger than you. Oh dear, check it out, if it fits you. But that won't necessarily work, because I already told her that I was wearing your stuff already. Ah. Oh, but it's you, know you tell people say I get money, you know, these Lagos girls are something else. Keep a low profile, if you want to remain anonymous. Do you know the weird thing? I actually enjoy working at Brixby. And it would be a shame if they actually knew who I was. Her name is Brixby. Her name is Dala. Okay, I try and keep up. Who is Brixby? What? That's the company that I work for. Of course I know. Just for me. No. Okay, then I'm still waiting for you to call um, November 21st. I called it to you, check your inbox and it's in there, check your something. Okay. Did you drive today? Sorry, my boyfriend is coming to pick me up. I was hoping I could hitch a ride with you. Hey, you can hitch a ride with Dala now. I'll be Dala. She is a good for you to follow me. Are you 
Good night. Dinner is served. I was thinking about them too forever. You know I didn't prep for this. I started everything from the scratch. But you knew I was coming to the office to pick you up, so you should have done an earlier preparation. See who is talking? You were supposed to come pick me up from the office and take me out for dinner. But no, I decided to come back home, prepare dinner for us to eat. A little appreciation from you wouldn't be a bad idea. Come, come on. on. Uh, uh, take things too personal. I was just joking. Someone close you again. Okay? Mm. Mm. Whoa. Whoa. That is so straight. Don't eat yet. Let me get something else and I'll be right back. Just wait for me. Don't eat yet. Dave, come on. You know how famished I am. And you want me to wait for you? Please wait. Uh, on your way back, you meet me eating. Take this to your accounts department. Okay. Okay. You owe me lunch. Do not bother asking me why. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Dala. Yeah. Can we talk? Sure. Why not? I know you'll be irritated. It's about two. Uh, mm -mm. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to hear it, please, please. I don't. Stella, please hear me out. I am not. Look, I'm not interested. Okay? And I'd like things between us to be strictly official. Please. Has it gotten to that? It has gotten to that. Because every single time Turner hurts you, I have been the shoulder you cry on. And it's draining. You have to keep going back to him. Please. I don't want to be part of it. The Allah and you will be irritated, but... What, who said who said so? I'm not irritated because it's none of my business. Okay? I just don't want to be your personal comforter. I beg. This is very really irritating. It's me right now. Amanda, are you on the last one fighting? Never mind.
They're still here. She packed the things and leave. It's past eight. What are you doing here, PJ? I was helping Philip in accounting with some filing. Oh, okay. He owes me lunch on Monday. I've really had a shitty day today. I know. All I need right now is a stiff drink and maybe a place to cry. You know what? If you pack up now and we'll leave together, I will buy you a stiff drink. But that whole place to cry, I'm sure I can help you that one. <laughs> That's all I mean. Okay? Okay, I'll do that. Alright, cool. Okay. PJ, mm -hmm. I have been really stupid. In fact, I'm a dumbass. Don't say that. No. You see, I might as well say that. Because the Allah warned me because um, what she saw, did I listen? No. Instead, I was busy talking about giving that idiot a second chance. Well, more than second chances. So was I, until I discovered that one can't give egomaniac second chance. You see, Tony was the reason why they say. Burn your enemies with fire so they can't rise again. I am serious, okay? I think I'm a little bit tipsy, yeah? <laughs> nah, I'm fine. I, I, I think the same is riches. I think the saying is suffer your suffer which is so that they may not live something similar. The war wherever which is demon. Are they not from the same clan? <laughs> okay. Did you just say clan? Um, <laughs> Tony doesn't treat me with respect. He cheats on me. And he lies unprovoked. <laughs> I think Tony is happy whenever I am depressed. <laughs> what are you still doing with him? What are you still doing with him? No. I think I feel so I, I feel so in, in, in insecure because I feel Tony is the best man I have ever dated and I'm happy with that's that Dollar leaves mess. Okay. Why are you telling me this? Because I know you like her. What makes you think that I like her? Because you are always talking about her. Madam, what do you need? Should I get you water or something? I want you to drink water. 
But if you drink water, you go to throw up. I want to drink water. <laughs> what? Wait, I'm so, what are you doing here? She got drunk and she couldn't drive, so I had to bring her home. Dala, I love you. I like that. Look, I don't love you and I've not forgiven you. Can we just, can we just take home, please? Uh, uh, My shoe. <laughs> You're still here? Yeah, I'm waiting for my Uber. Um, okay. I was outside, I saw you bringing her in, but uh, I knew it wasn't Tony, but I also didn't know it was you. I thought it was a strange man who drugged her and wanted to dump her body here. You have a very vivid and strange imagination. <laughs> you know, right? Well, I, I can't really blame her because the cheating boyfriend and you calling me your best friend can do that to you. Tony cheated again? Hey, yeah. She saw him with another woman at the film station. God, that guy is a... Men has come, really? I agree, we are scum. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, and I'm, I'm also not sorry because <laughs> I don't know. I get that. It's fine. It's alright. Uh, so... Hello? Yeah, okay. Uh, I'll be outside in a few seconds. Uh, thank you. Well, I'll wait. But, um, I love how you're overprotective of her. I think we all need friends like you in our lives. Good night. Good night. Enjoy your weekend. Okay? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Drink up. Why are you taking it that way? Come on. I don't know. I don't like green tea. You don't have a choice. Stay. <laughs> it's too hot. Hold it. Hold it. Sorry. Drink up. It will help you. Thanks, Dala, for staying the night with me. Honestly, I don't deserve your friendship. True, true. You're right, you don't deserve it. I am sorry I didn't listen to you. You were right about Tony. I thought I could give him the benefit of doubt. Um, babe, can I tell your friend to step aside? Tony, get out of my house! What are you talking? Get out of my house, Tony! Look, look at you. What do you think you are? A bloody desperado like you? Come and think of it, I will be trying to tolerate your bloody ass. Okay, okay. You've said enough, Oga. Okay? Oga, okay, can you now leave, please? Go. Hey, I saw you. I say it! No, Tony, please say it. Say one more useless word from your mouth, and we both die here. Say it! <laughs> oh, because you think you have this tiny carrot in between your legs. You can talk to anybody anyhow, Abby. It is me, oh. I'm not Amanda, oh. I will mess you up. I will fuck you up. You poverty stricken hustler. Get out of this house now, please. Get out, get out, get out. Tony, go! Go! Um, I have nothing to say to you. It is your mother that is frustrated, Tony. It is your mother that is frustrated. Get out! Get out! Back for me, Richard. He's yours. Hustler. Foolish human being. Look at how he even looks, Seth. That tiny carrot in between his legs. I don't even know what you saw in this, in this stupid guy. What are you, why are you crying? Why are you crying? Why are you, why are you not even cucumber?
I want to quickly thank you for what you did for me yesterday. I'm so embarrassed for getting drunk. We were a solid guy for listening to my relationship rules. And making sure I got home safe. I owe you a big one. What you owe me is lunch or dinner this coming weekend. Mm. Uh -huh. Lunch or dinner? At my place or yours? It will have to be yours. My friend is expecting a special guest, so I had to give them their privacy. So please, your place. Lunch at my place on Saturday, please, then. Alright, thank you. You're welcome. Hold on. Do you have any favorite thing you? In mind, you would like me to prepare for you? Lasagna. In you know what? Lasagna. Hey, 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 I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been. I've not heard of that before. <laughs> I'm actually here for PJ. When was the last time you spoke to him? The day he moved out. Mommy Haba, it's been months now. Patrick is spoiled. And I admit that spoiled him. But I'm not gonna go looking for him. I don't want him to take advantage of my love again. He's on his own. Mommy. See, I'm not here to guilt trip you, but. Okay, fine. I have good news. Good news? News that will make you proud of him. What has he done this time? Nothing. Patrick is in Lagos. And he's been working ever since. He's in Lagos with who? <sighs> he didn't tell me. He said he's with an old friend. No name, no address. Mm, one of his child. But anyway, it's a lie. Patrick is in this Abuja. He's here. A friend of mine told me they saw him at one club like that. All drunk. I mean, it's not everything you hear about PJ that you believe or PJ is in Lagos and I believe him. Mommy Something. Yes, uh, this was delicious. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm glad you liked it. I mean, what's there not to like? I'm not now. Sit down first now. Why in a hurry? Okay. I was thinking that you should start like a catering service. Don't let this talent waste. Uh, no, 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 PJ. Don't even go there. I can't cook commercially. I just love making people around me happy and well fed. Yeah? You know what? Let's make a deal. Okay. Marry me. I keep making me happy and well-fed, like for the rest of my life. Fiji, you're, not serious. Uh, no, okay. you're <laughs> not serious. You're not serious. You're not serious. Come on. But how come at the office you always seem to have this unfriendly attitude? Uh, well, I'm, I'm sorry. I tend to focus more on my job than any other thing else. No. Oh. I don't think that it's a bad thing, you know, but. Unless someone gets close to you, they might misinterpret your attitude. I don't get. Did anyone misinterpret me to you? No, 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 no. That didn't happen. No. Just saying. Um, PJ, you see, um, Brigsby is a very small office and gossip tends to spread easily. I. I don't want. Um, what I actually do is just to mind my business and then face the job that pays me and avoid too much gossip. That's fair. What? <laughs> Nothing. Look at the time. I need to run. This was amazing. I had a great time. Yeah, um, okay. In that case, I have to get my car keys so I can. 
drop it off. No, 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 there's no need to do that. I already ordered a new one. You did? Yeah. Oh, okay, so then let me clear the table. I'm part, eh? Yeah? You. I said noticing some kind of connection between both of you. You and Pat. I was only being nice and friendly. Uh uh. If I didn't know you better, eh? I would have said you to have started. Oh, it's fine. It's okay. Let me just win and get out of here. It's fine. Just Jesus jump down. Whoa! You're so disgusting. How am I disgusting? I did someone I work with. A junior staff for that matter. That junior staff? He's handsome. He smells good. And he's got swag. Why can't you date him? Why can't oh you date him? Dala. He's nice and friendly. Besides, I haven't met a junior staff that's that friendly and hardworking. A guy that loves his job. True that, like true that. He loves his job. But if he makes a move, go for it and please let me know. Big two, continue. Last card and check up who's the boss, babe. I'm going to the cinema to see a movie. I was not that if a guy, because that guy looks suspicious. Guy, if he's straight, I mean, he has a girlfriend, okay? And that guy is always looking at your bum, like, you know, he's not. No, I'm just saying, you know. Anyway, I'm going to see the movie with Amanda. But I like the way you spend money now, you're more prudent. But you see, you're womanizing. Ah, that one, I'll go down with you. Nah, man, I want womanizing. I'm going to the cinema with Amanda, my colleague, to see a movie. Yeah, that's how it starts now. From watching movie next week, she'll be under the TV shouting, Oh, BJ! Oh, BJ! I have no idea me. what kind of oh my God. you're watching. Ah, 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 ah. Because it's just a movie. She's just my colleague and that's all. Sha, don't go and love them. And they leave them, break their heart and go to Abuja. Because if you try and I swear to God, I'll bring the girl to your house personally. Bro. Oh, I know I've had this chief of Kelangu, he will not let me rest on. This one, he's been begging me to marry him. Eh? God forbid. I will transfer his account to Ife. I knew he liked you. From the way he kept on calling you for trivial issues. My young guy is never finished with this Nigerian. And my papa mate, I will come marry. God forbid. God forbid. God forbid. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dala. What? Remember you said, if Pat asks me out, I should give it a shot. <laughs> no, I won't die. No. I think there was more to this girl you're exhibiting. <laughs> Go! Are you serious? Yes. Just me now. But that I'm worried. About what? You know we work in the same office. I don't understand. Is it today you stay hearing about office romance? I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. <laughs> Now. I'm here now. I didn't hear now. Which one I just uh, do love in Tokyo? Yeah, what's wrong with you, man? <laughs> Wait, let me tell you to be about this guy. Wait, I'm not drinking. Right? Mm. So, mm? the name PG came about because it was a man about town. <laughs> Let's talk about when two girls were fighting for him. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that, that is not true. That is so not true. Today, I lost a best friend. Yeah, I'm fine. It's just the printers. I, I just got the printing room. I was supposed to get the receipt booklet for the money show, guys. And what the printers are, what the machines keeps on jamming, so it's not going to be ready today. Calm down. Those money trick guys won't come today. So don't worry. Call Nick, I'll tell him you deliver the booklet to the office tomorrow and he'll be glad. Thank you. 
One more thing. I know you and Amanda. You guys are now. No, it's okay with me. Look, 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 I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm alright. But I just hope you just don't want to chop and run. No, 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 no. Why do I want to do that? I'm not trying to chop and run or whatever. She's, she's really cool. I actually like her. She's a genuinely nice person and she makes me a much better person. So have you told her? What? I told her why you need some energy. That you are a felon. Have you told her? You mean what? That, that way that I'm a felon. I <laughs> Look, if you like her, come on, come with her. I don't want a situation where that you'll fall in love with you. Then police will trace you all the way from Abuja down here and arrest you. Who made me this stuff? stuff? You, you really actually think that I'm a fellow? Because I don't believe all these expensive things you wear from your friends. I actually think you bought them with the money you stole from the company you worked out. So you come out clean, otherwise I will. He said you want to come and see the acting end. So what's going to happen? He said, uh, I don't know, Shao, but Tokumba is saying that they might want to take over Breeze by fully and integrate their own staff. So so they're going to sack all of us? I don't know. I better start circulating my CV. As for me, I'm not going to react based on speculation. I am going to wait until tomorrow. You are going to wait? I will wait. Are you serious? Yes, I am serious. Yeah, what if it's rumor? Me, what I know is I'll start my own midnight prayer now. Oh, this doesn't even make sense. What are you trying to do now? Wait, has anyone heard anything from the investors? No, I've not heard anything. <sighs> Me neither. Ah, Lady and carrying fake news, eh? Hmm. I don't think it's a rumor. Lady won't tell us something that is that important if it was not true. Right? Yeah. Alright. Like you know her. You know her too well. Fake that and carry fake news everywhere. Of course. Alright, y'all. Hi, sir. 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 This is Mrs. Linda Edozi Amanze, the CEO of Padedo Group, Abuja. Wow! Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. You're welcome. You're welcome, ma'am. Thank you. Hey, guys. What are you ready? Oh, okay. Where is Samuel from? PJ. What are you doing here? Sis, please. Not here. Please. We had no idea that he is the CEO of Padedo Group. It's okay. You don't need to apologize. I'm sure Mr. PJ here has his reasons for not telling who he is just to get the job. You know, aside all this, how much is the salary of an um, operation assistant? That's 50000 now. What? Sir, so please, can you excuse us? Fifty thousand naira. What are you doing here? Did that tell you it's going to help me or to disgrace me? I came here for progress assessment because Patedo Group owns Brisbane Incorporated. Since when? Since last year. This company was bankrupt. They needed someone to buy it, and we did. Well, dear brother. If you had shown any interest in the morning potato group, you would have known this. <laughs> Wait, so you are telling me that I have been working for our company all this time? Exactly. <laughs> That's a crazy turn. <laughs> crazy turn. You just wait till mom and dad is about this. Okay. Like, did I 
hear him call CEO Cis. Hey, it means that they are, they are saying this. So how come Omoka? That's also his name now. Oh. His name is Pat Eduze Onka Junior. Ah, that's why they call him PJ. I knew there was something, something about this guy doesn't add up. His perfumes, his shoes, his wristwatches, his shirts, his trousers, all designers, God! Do you know that I asked him about those clothes? He said he has a friend that comes in from Kotonu, he brings his gun-out materials. Man, this guy lying, he enter. So you really want him back? Mm-hmm. I'm worried. Just give him another chance. Hello? Yes, Patrick, it's your mother. A flight to Abuja has been booked for you. Yes, but tomorrow morning, your father and I would like to talk to you. Thank you. Which people are their problems if? Which guy will allow me this one? I don't know, man. I know I used to joke about wanting to go back to Abuja, but right now, I think I want to just stay in Lagos. You must go. Let's go back to Abuja. That has always been your dream. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. If I go back to Abuja, I know my family won't have anything good to say. They're just going to keep criticizing me. And I can literally hear my father screaming at the top of his lungs about how I've come to Lagos. Come and shame the family. Shame them how? Shame them how? What do you mean shame them? You came to Lagos, you got an honest man's job. You're earning honest pay. So which kind of shame? Your family surely can't be that detached from reality. That's not what I'm worried about. I'm worried about what my sister has gone to and say to them. Or a leave, whatever it is she has said, you get there first and hear what they will say. Can't be here and deciding what, what, what's right and what's wrong. No, what was Amanda's reaction? I don't know. I'm sure that she was shocked. That she didn't back to just part. I, I don't know. I, I was upstairs, I left the office, I went to dive bar, had a couple of drinks, and I just came home. So you're not going to tell her you're going to have a job tomorrow? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Am I Hey. I guess my sickness is out. What was the pretense all about? You coming to office, acting like a poor job seeker, blending into system like one of us. I am one of you. She was never one of us, PJ. About that, I'm sorry. I didn't want you to find out like this, and I had no idea that my sister was the mysterious investor. PJ, when were you going to tell me the truth about his father? Eventually. I'm just trying to set up certain things in my life, that's all. Please. PJ, leave my house. I leave Abuja tomorrow. Please, just hear me out. Safe trip as you travel, PJ. Please leave. PJ, leave me alone. Leave my house. Go. PJ, go.
Patrick, Dad, your mother and I have deliberated on your issue and after a very careful thought we've decided to give you one last chance. You will resume work as the CEO of Potato Group. <sighs> Thank you so much. I promise that I won't let you down. However, there's one clause. Whatever project or investment that you choose to embark upon must first of all be discussed with Linda. And you will have no free access to funds unless you approve it. Are you good with that? That's fine, mommy. All right. Mm. You have something to add? Not really. Nothing much. But for you, I'm not going to be tolerating you bringing in women into the house. That's fine. If you have to do that, you have to do it outside the house. Well, I'm not even about that life anymore. Are you sure? 100%. Hey, he has a girlfriend in Lagos. Pichi! Girlfriend? Is it a serious relationship? Uh, I'm working on it. Huh? Well. Let's just hope all this humanizing thing is going to be over with. Well, Mom, well, actually, the MD said that um, for the few months he was working in the company, that he was very hardworking and dedicated. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Look, whether I was running is besides the point. The point is, I kept myself busy and I didn't go to ask anyone for any assistance. <laughs> this calls for a celebration. Oh. Yes, please, please. Go and call Mrs. Devon. Okay. To bring glasses for the wine I left in the fridge. Yes! Mom, well, I trust you to have <laughs> drinks cooling. Well, I'm going to expect you to celebrate my song and expect her change. <laughs> Okay. I don't understand. I just sit here. Rubbish. Uh huh. Have you heard from Pat? But we tried calling him. I tried calling him several years, but I felt he wanted to take my calls because of the way I treated him the last time. But he knew you were upset. And he can't blame me for that. Anyone could have acted the same way. Yes, of course, I know, but Pat came here to apologize to me and to explain to me, but I didn't give him a chance. That's why you have to call him. I can't. And I won't. It's been days now I haven't heard from him. I guess he must have weighed his options and decided I'm not worth the stress. Can you stop this attitude? I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Call him! That I'd rather quit than calling him. I can't imagine working in Brixby office knowing knowing that Pat and his family owns the company. I can't. Are you are, are you serious about quitting? Yes. That's insane. The more I think about this, the more I feel it's the best thing for me to do. Let me just quit and have my peace. Please.
your life will keep me always suffocating. Never come and kiss your papa to police. I'll you from afar, but you always on the run. Oh my God.